Hey guys, I'm almost sick again. <sighs> I have a fever and I'm achy and my wife said, you have a fever, you can't go to work. And I said, no, no, I can work. And she's like, no, but don't make Dan sick. So my wife cares more about whether Dan's sick than whether I'm sick. His wife is pregnant. Yeah. Whatever. She's going to get sick too. Yeah, okay. So that's a decent excuse, but still, I could have worked. Whatever. So now I'm in bed and I'm bored. By the way, my wife is holding the camera. That's why I'm so far away. I should probably speak up, but it hurts a bit because I have a headache. But I was bored in bed and we we're watching the new TV. Have you seen the new TV? This is the one that didn't work. And now it works. Uh, thanks, Mom and Dad, for having a broken TV for just a couple of minutes. Because now I have a working TV. And we love it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um... I was bored in bed and I didn't feel like watching TV anymore. I wanted to get out of bed, but Marie won't let me out of the room. So I started going through my closet uh, just because I needed something to do. So I was organizing it. And then my wife was like, what are you doing? I'm like, these are the old clothes. I'm going to like sort them into piles and uh, throw out the ones that I don't like or don't want. And she said, hey, I bet some of those fit you now because you're so thin because look this shirt I can't even like make it go all the way to the max stretchy and before I used to be a max stretchy just putting it on sometimes I wouldn't wear this because it's like doing this <laughs> and now it's like I'm feeling pretty good about it like you put it on and this is like straight out of the washer and dryer so it should have been at the smallest and it's still loose so so then I was scared because my wife's like you should try on the pants that didn't fit and so here they are on the, well, here are some of them. I have lots of pairs of pants, but here are four that I wear on a, that I used to wear all the time that are a drastic change. I started wearing about size 40, size 42, depending on whether it was a jean or a dress pant. Uh, there's a new, uh, there's jeans I buy at Costco that are made out of elastic things, and I can pull off wearing a 38 for those because they stretch. <laughs> So, uh, so I, I, I'm about a 40 jeans and a 42 dress pant when I started the revolution. And uh, so my wife's like, you should try them on. And I didn't want to. I, don't want, I haven't tried them on yet. I don't know if they fit. And I kind of don't want to because I feel like it'll depress the hell out of me if they don't fit. But we chose pants that are 36 or 38, depending on the jean or dress pants. So two full pant sizes down. If I wore a 40 jeans, now there's a 36 jeans. So, and a 42 dress pant, and these are 38 dress pants. So it's a big jump, and I'm a little worried about it. But my wife says I'm way thinner. So, uh, so uh, these next few cross dissolves are going to be me trying on these pants. Oh, by the way, these are a size that, I, when I started the revolution, I didn't wear them because I couldn't even get the zip together. And, uh, and or put the button on. Like, not the ones where it was tight and it hurt, but the ones I physically couldn't get together. So we'll see how drastic a change that is. Oh, and my wife's also not wearing pants. <laughs> She's <laughs> almost naked right now holding the camera. Isn't that sexy? You're not gonna. Wow. <laughs> All right, so the next couple of cross dissolves will be me trying different pants. All right, these are dress type pants uh, that I would wear Really wrinkly pants. Well, they're really wrinkly because they're bunched up in the corner because I can't wear them. They didn't, like I said, I can, I can get these about this far. So, uh, by the end, I started wearing these uh, with my belt and did not done up. The belt was holding it together. It was really bad. Okay. Now, like I said, I don't think this will fit. And I'm going to be sad if they don't. Because I thought I was doing so good, but if I can't even fit into a pair, oh, yeah, they're a bit tight. Yeah, I can get them done up now, and I'm sure by the end of the day they would be fine, but it is a little bit tight here. Not a whole lot. These are very wearable. I could definitely wear them, but they are tight. Uh, but they're not tight in the crotchular area. Like they usually were. So that's not too bad. Alright, so let's do the next These pair. are my jean type pants that I wear when I don't want to wear jeans or when I need something kind of blacker or 
something that, you know, some bars don't let you go in if you're wearing jeans and I'm comfortable in jeans. So these are like jeans, but they don't look like jeans. And again, they didn't fit at all. Oh, it's a, uh, feels almost tight around. But they were always oh. tighter. <laughs> Uh, yeah, tight in the testicular area. Oh no! See these two. These are still. I can still get them on. But no, these I would not be. Oh, they're not too bad. But yeah, I would not feel comfortable wearing these. So we're not ready for these ones yet. Just turn around and see. I don't have a bum. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, we have a special guest. Pickle is uh, hanging out with us. But I gotta stay far away from Pickle. Yeah, you don't want her to get sick. Yeah. Just because she was getting fussy. Alright, next pair of pants. And these are my Tommy Hilfiger khakis. This is what I would wear for lunch at the club. Or when I go golfing. I don't do any of those things. Uh, these are just khakis because you, sometimes you need khakis. Uh, when I was working on the boat, oh man, I can't believe I was thinner on the boat. So I was getting kind of chunky there too. Anyway, shut up and put some pants on. Put some pants on. All right. Oh, All right. Uh -huh. that's nice. Oh well, yeah, these are just like the first pair. They're a little bit tight, but definitely wearable. I could definitely pull it off. I think. At the end of the, oh, except that I'm new, I am getting the fat people stretch, and it's, yeah, so maybe not, maybe not yet, we're not there yet, but at least they close now, that's nice. Kind of a muffin top. <laughs> kind of a muffin top, thank you. All right, this next is my pair. favorite pair of beat up jeans, these are what we, I used to call my weekend jeans, because they're shredded, and they're all messed up, and old, and faded, and really comfortable and I used to wear guest jeans exclusively because I like the cut and they were really comfortable and then I got so big that even guess is like you're too big you, I, you okay Pickle? What you doing? You're just screaming? <laughs> I had to stop wearing guess because guess was like you're too fat we don't make pants for you fatty and so uh Actually, this is, I think, the biggest size I could get from them at the time. I think these are... No, these are 36s. I have a pair of 38s that also don't fit. These are the ones that I want to fit. These are 36. Again, this is two pant sizes lower than I normally wear. So I'm not expecting them to fit. But it is nice that they almost fit. And it's only been, what, like 37 days? Yeah. It's day 37 today, I think. Yeah. Go diggle. Oh, well, these are actually looser in the everywhere. In the everywhere? Yeah. That's cool. Just, oh. Tava, the boxer, they're almost gone. Ah. <laughs> Dirty. <laughs> did you like. Did you pan down? Zoom in. Oh, these are actually kind of really comfortable. Mm, you could actually wear those when, these like ones today. I'm just gonna wash them because they've been like up there for, I don't know. A long time. Well, I'm happy these fit. These are the ones I wanted to fit because the other ones I really don't care about. But this, oh, 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 oh. Maybe let's go buy some more guest pants. I now wear 36 again. Maybe I should wait. Maybe in, in the end of 90 days I'll be wearing 34s. Yeah. Yeah, it's and not going to happen. They cost a lot, those pants. Yeah, I know, but they're so worth it. Yeah. That's, that's our reward. Like buying new clothes. Yeah, that's smaller. Uh, uh, yeah. We should probably make that like a question in one of the episodes. How do you reward yourself? Because yeah, but Divi and Danny asked that, and oh, I'm like, yeah, she did. you know what? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I we don't, don't know reward, how we reward myself. ourselves because it's like, oh, we did good. Just losing weight is a big yeah, reward, but I think that's it. I think just it's... new clothes is fun too. You can talk into the camera. Hello. <laughs> She put clothes on. Yeah, no. Sorry. Everybody was like, yes, wait, no. no she got that... dressed in one There's... of the cross dissolves. Ah. I'm naked. <laughs> Woo. Oh, no, I have pants on again. <laughs> You're always naked. <laughs> yeah. People are getting used to it now. Yeah. But hey, when I suck it in and flex my obstacles and flex, 
that's at least, you know, <laughs> more fun to look at than my first video. No more to you. <laughs> All right. Um, I need to get back to bed because now I'm feeling a little dizzy. And I'm sorry. And very, very hot and, uh... Yeah. So I'm go to bed. To get a little bit of a headache from all the light. Are you, we had to, uh, you're gonna put your clothes away now? Maybe. I don't think you want a soup or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can do a soup. And maybe I'll go back to watching a TV or something. But yeah. we'll bring these blinds down because they're hurting my brain. I'm sorry, but the light was really bad in yeah, this room. Uh, as long as it works. So there's your blog for today. Happy day 37. Um, <laughs> yesterday, I didn't even mention any of my workouts yesterday. Uh, Dan and I worked out, uh, at our lunch break yesterday. And then when I got home, we were going to work out, but everything, with everything happening and all the things we had to do, it was 10 o'clock when we would have started. And, uh, so that didn't happen. And now I'm feeling a little bit ill, but I did see that the video was max recovery. So I'm hoping it's like the cardio recovery video and I'll be able to do it uh, if I, you know, I'm going to take a nap and watch some TV and we'll see. Eat a nice soup. And uh, hey, check out wife's blog uh, for today. Uh, that's where you'll get the information on whether or not we did anything because uh, this was going to be my blog for today. I'm going to set it up and uh, yeah, you guys can watch that. I've been working on a very special blog for tomorrow. Um, so look forward to that. Tomorrow is going to be a very different blog that I hope you like. It's, uh, I don't think I'm going to do too many of them like that, but I think it's going to be interesting. It's going to be different from what we did, because I, I figure you're probably tired of me just talking at you. So, uh, it's going to be something For completely different tomorrow. So look forward to that. Check out the episodes. If you haven't checked out the episodes, check out Dan, AO Boss, TKD, Deviant Danny, uh, Check out all those people. It, it just, actually, you know what? Forget about the rainbow stuff and the clicking on the stuff here. At the very least, open the description box and go read what's in there and click the links from there. Because it's easier. Because then, then at least you get to watch the video while you're reading the description. Whereas the other ones you have to like leave the video. Then some people forget to go back and click on things. Why can't I just end a video? Why can't I just go, all right, that's it, it's okay, over. Okay, you want me to do it up. for you? No, no, I'll do it. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Do I have to high-five? Bye, Minu. No high-five? High-five, high-five. Uh. Uh. Okay, see you later. <laughs>